The university's blue light system was initiated to keep students safe, but waiting for campus safety to arrive on the scene or arriving to a blue light that's out of order could cost students their lives. The blue light system alerts campus safety of the specific light that was pressed. An operator will begin speaking and ask you information on your whereabouts and if you're in any immediate danger. The university's website details student safety protocol, but has no information relating to the blue light system. Other colleges, like USF, have upgraded their student safety with an app containing a mobile blue light. Uh, I don't. I think they could be helpful in different situations, like if someone has like alcohol poisoning and is throwing up. But like if someone's chasing after you, then I don't think it would be helpful in that situation. However, if a cell phone is unavailable, the blue lights are a student's second resource to contact campus safety. The blue light system does have its piece that is a safety thing. We have seen instances, for example, where somebody get, may get robbed and their cell phone is taken, so they have no other way to be able to contact safety, uh, campus safety. So that is an important component to provide an environment and a, a piece of technology, no matter how low tech it is or high tech it is, to immediately call for assistance. Although the blue light initiative may seem like a good idea, the best thing to do if you feel you're in danger is to run to a safe space and call 911. Emily Cortez, UTTV, Spartan News.